Hey, what's going on guys? Chris back with you with another review video, and this is going to be for a shoe cleaner. It comes with other parts in it. We're going to get to that in just a second here. Sometimes when you go golfing or whatever, scuff up your shoes, you get them dirty. And with this bag, we'll get your shoes clean and also protect your machine as well. And this is what I personally do. I wash all my shoes. And just like all my review videos, in the description box below is going to be the link for this exact same shoe cleaner bag for your laundry machine. That will be linked in the description box below. You guys in the UK, if they sell it in the UK, I will have you guys linked as well. If not, one very similar to it. So without further ado, let's go over to the counter, see what else is inside the box. Hey guys, if you're new here, welcome. We have a lot of fun here. Smash that subscribe button down below and turn on your bell notifications so when fresh content comes out, you're the first to know. All right, inside the box, we have again two of these for each individual shoe and nice and large for your size shoes, the width and dimensions there. Obviously, if you're size like 16 or 18, you probably might not be able to use these, but they are pretty long. I'll show you my size 10 and a half and the room remaining. As we can see here, microfiber on the outside and the inside, ventilated on this side as well with netting. And then it zips down and we look in and microfiber on the inside as well. This is the same type of material that you would wash your car, the microfiber, it's absolutely beautifully soft. You could literally lay your head on this as like a pillow. And then we also have in the box, we have two different sizes of shoehorns, I believe these are, and they are adjustable to the different sizes right here for small, medium, and large. Same thing on this one here, small, medium, and large, and that is for the wider shoes. And this would be kind of for your thinner ones here. So I'm probably going to have to use these wider ones for my Nikes that I'm going to be putting in. So let's go ahead and grab my Nikes and let me go ahead and dump them on in there and we'll give it a go. And actually these are my nine and a half. They run a lot larger than the actual size indicates. But anyway, so we have this here. I adjusted the size right here. Slip that bad boy in the left one and then just tuck it on down. That will keep the shape of the shoe if you're concerned about that. I typically just wash my shoes without those, but if the product comes with it, you might as well use it. And the toe is all the way up at the front right here. And again, these are nine and a halfs. And we have at least another two inches here in the back. And then obviously if it's extending more, this would zip up and just push back up against that. So my guess is you could easily fit up to size like 13, 14 shoe in here, you know, with the expandable back zipper part, even probably a size 15. But even if we're pushing it forward there, putting a little bit of more tension on the front net, then we have a lot more room there as well. So you could fit, you could fit some pretty big shoes in here, but not too many of us have to deal with that size 15 plus shoe. So let's go ahead and zip it on up. Let's do the same thing to this one, then we'll throw it on the washing machine. I have a really nice front loader and I threw some of my other laundry in there too. Might as well not waste water. So again, we have our bags, shoes are inside. Let's go ahead and throw them on in there and let's go ahead and load it on up. We put laundry detergent in as normal. And we're just letting it whip around there real nice. Alrighty, time is up and let's see what we got going on here, folks. Let's go ahead and pull these bad boys out. Looking fantastic. Let's go ahead and see what we got. Alrighty, it was a little tricky. I had to set the camera down to unzip it there. But let's see what we got. Nice. Look at the whites on there. Doing a lot better. Looking great. I already had those scuffs in there, don't worry about that. These are older shoes, but looking fantastic. Definitely a nice crisp shine to them. They definitely look better than they did when I first put them in there. Not to mention protecting my washing machine and looking fantastic. Let's go ahead and pull this bad boy out here. A little tricky with one hand, but we got it right there. That's looking great. Shoes are looking great, and they're smelling a lot better as well. Here's the other shoe, looking a lot better as well. I typically do this after trail running or mountain biking just because the shoes get so beat up. And you can dry them if you really want to. I typically, what I just do is I just kind of air dry them like this on the ground. And you can throw them in here if you want, obviously. 
it's up to you if you want to dry your shoes. If you're worried about shrinking, I just typically just set them again next to the dryer, let them air dry overnight, and then I'll put them away in the morning. Well, guys, they did the trick. I'm definitely impressed. These are nice and solid quality as well. Very nice, soft shoe cases here for washing. These things held up really well. I washed it on super hot water. These guys are running real smoothly, keeping the structure of the shoe. Again, in the description box is going to be this exact same product. You guys can read more reviews about it. Pick one up yourself. That will be linked in the description box below. You guys, again, in the UK, I will have the same one linked or one very similar to it. You guys have a wonderful day. Hit that thumbs up button it if it has helped you. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye. Don't let the party stop, guys. Hit one of these videos continue to watch we'll see you soon